Let's see here. Which uh, is that? Uh, is it on? Can you hear me? I can hear you. All right. how, about, you? how about now? Can you see? I can hear you good. Okay. There we go. There we go. I had to figure out which one was not on. So, all right, uh, and let me figure out where the cameras are here. There's that one, and uh, there we go. So we got a camera right here. So, hello, hello. all right, man. Uh, first of all, thank you so much for being a part of the showcase this year, and I hope you had a lot of fun. What was your What was your first impression of it? Oh my God, overwhelming! Right? <laughs> for, for meeting all the great people, all the the faces and the voices that I've been listening to now for the last couple months. Sure. And then walking into to Rick's and Dirty Harry's and just seeing the great artists, the great people the fans yeah. just this this was an overwhelming and such a great experience for well, good. myself good i know there was a lot of reef rum uh, you know every time i said how many people had reef rum yeah you know so <laughs> well, great, the greatest testament was right rick's running out of it that's right, right. that's exactly. right they sold through it yeah we got a fire uh, a three alarm here you know we're out of reef rum you know so he says, okay i'll be right back but uh yeah, so, uh, well, you know, it's it's good. I uh, always love it when uh, people that we work with uh, on a, a normal basis gets to come on the road with us and see, you know, the, what we do on the road. It's a whole different gig, but uh, it takes a whole year to plan for that, you know. Yeah, it's amazing to watch just the whole behind the scenes, how this how this came together, what you guys do during the show, why everything, you know, why the band's playing and how you guys operate. It's just, it was a beautiful education on the process well brian and i have been uh, working from day one along with all of our volunteers uh you know hippie chick and michelle and everybody to uh, uh put this thing uh to make sure that it runs smooth you don't have a lot of this uh this artist not showing up and uh you know this equipment not working and a, a lot of downtime you didn't have any of that and because we make sure that the people that are involved with it know what they're doing they know what time to be there how long they're going to play and then it's a seamless uh thing where they come off the stage we'll grab them for an interview while the next artist is uh setting up and then boom they go so i got i gotta tell you i worked with a whole bunch of different organizations down this last this last couple days and this was by far the best and smoothest operation and everything went off like clockwork people were where they were supposed to be when they were supposed to be so kudos to the team and to everybody here for your help and support yeah. just i'm patting a, you on the back yeah, okay. what a great event you guys throw it was spectacular well there there was this one moment where i hid his clipboard and uh, i thought he was going to have a heart attack because he's got all of his notes on there but he found it and, you know but uh anyway i know you guys got to head off to the airport but uh tell everybody how's how's it going with refrom refrom we're doing well. We're doing well. We, we just signed a deal with the Tampa Bay Lightning to be the official partner of the Tampa Bay Lightning. So come if you're up in the Tampa region or in the arena, come over and ask for some reef rum. That's awesome. We, we're now in – we are selling in New York, New Jersey, Florida, and South Carolina. Of All course, right. we can ship to your home state, to most home states, not right. your home state, but <laughs> yeah. to most home states. Well, we're going to work on that when we get back. We'll I have a that. distributor at our local uh, in Harrison Bay there, distributor that's uh, helped us out in the past with reggae wines and some other uh, sponsors we worked with. So I believe if I can hook you guys up and have a conversation with him, I'm going to meet with him this uh, next week. Uh, and um, so we'll see uh, see how it goes. That would be great. That's we got to you know, at this point, the main thing is get it in Tennessee. <laughs> <laughs> Wherever you are, if you're in any of the states, ask for us. That's, that helps us the most. If you go into your liquor store, your bar, your restaurant, your hotel, wherever, if you ask for you from, even if they don't help, have it, it helps us when we call. And they say, oh, yeah, people have been asking for your product. That's that right. really does help yes. us. Yes. And, of course, you always use the word code uh, Tiki Man. That lets him know, number one, that that, uh, that, that orders come, they have come through uh, Tiki Man Radio at some point in time or another. That helps us out tremendously. Tremendously, but it helps him track it, and of course, uh, you get free shipping on your first order with that code, right? That is correct. Okay. Uh, let me. I, I don't know if we ever really talked about it, but uh, so you're just laying in bed one night thinking, I want to op open up a run company. Is that what happened? Uh, well, absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> we like to say this came out of boredom and stupidity, right? Yeah. <laughs> so we. So you're out in the garage. Let's <laughs> see what this tastes like. I mean, you know, yeah. <laughs> New Jersey. We were locked down during COVID. Right. You know, we had the strictest lockdown. Like yeah. everybody else, we sure. Were, we started drinking. Yeah. And so we saw on Instagram, <laughs> we fa we saw this little uh, half liter uh, bar wooden barrel where you can age your own spirit. Yeah. We don't know anything about aging our own spirits, but we're bored. We're stuck at home. <laughs> so we start aging. Now, we, I was a tequila drinker. She's a wine drinker. We yeah. didn't even, but we didn't have a rum that we liked. I'm like, let's just try a rum. So we start playing around, and 37 iterations later, we come up with something we like. Really? Right? And so we're like, okay, this is the boredom part. We Okay, this is great. 
lockdowns lift, I start traveling for my day job, and I start handing out mini bottles to people, not for any intention other than here's what I did for you know during the yeah. last four months. Yeah, and it started getting really great reactions, and so they're like, "Hey, man, you got more of those little <laughs> bottles," <laughs> <laughs> and that's exactly what happened. That's, many months later, the stupidity part came in. We're like, "Let's create a rum brand," <laughs> <laughs> which has been a lot of fun. It's this has been an adventure, and we get to meet a lot of fun people and experiences we never hear i'm on the radio never was on the radio before right so this is just something new and exciting. aren't these aren't these fun yeah. the first time he put me on the radio i was like well we had She's microphones like, i tapped it and hello said, hello hello yeah <laughs> My, I didn't know I, what to say. I remember my brother Sam when he first got on Facebook. His first post was "Hello." <laughs> <laughs> yep, yep, yep. That was uh, about the same. Yeah, it was about like that. But uh, you know, there's a couple things um, that uh, we need to get you involved with. You know, Panama City. We need to talk about Panama yep. City because this is going to be our tenth year broadcasting that event. We've got a huge tent that uh, we're going, and we have, we have oceanfront property right next to the stage. So. Uh, and you may you may have noticed that everywhere I go, there's a crowd of people. So, <laughs> and then we got the summer party. You know, I mean, uh, you you saw all those pictures of people that brought reef rum to the summer party because I was like, you know, I was really working it. Like, you know, yeah, he's like it, well, my birthday. Yeah. Well, we got the chocolate bar, the tiki bar, the upper deck bar, the side bar, all this stuff, and and uh, people generally bring things, right? You know, alcohol. Yeah, I love that, right? Look, look what I got you. Let's drink it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, but anyway, so uh, you know, I'm like, listen, if you're bringing alcohol, bring reef rum. That's it. It's my birthday. You got to do it. You know. And so <laughs> we were working the sales side of that too. But uh, we had a lot of reef rum. We got a great picture on the tiki bar with all that rum, and uh, we use it as promotions now all the time. So, uh, but yeah, there's a couple of those events, and of course, uh, you know, back down to uh, where we else we go? Oh, we're going to Costa Rica. Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, May oh, for the Escape to Paradise. Mm-hmm. Uh, we got 42 people going with us. These guys are going to Costa Rica, aren't well, you? Now, now she wants to talk. Now all of a sudden she's yeah. not shy anymore. <laughs> we're back over there. She's, it's like, how do I get in on that? Well, from a tax purpose, you can send her down and do research. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is true. Yeah, but uh, man, I I know you guys got to get to the airport, but uh, I just wanted to uh, take time to uh, thank you for being uh, down here here and um, you know t- having faith in Tiki Man Radio first of all that uh, we'll do what we say we do because uh, you know character seems to be a lost art these days so it's very important that uh, you back up what uh, you say you can do oh, and we appreciate it listen at any sponsor or if you're thinking about working with these people great group of people they do what they say and be beyond and above and beyond I should guess. Well, there yeah. you go so thank you guys all thank right you. we're gonna let you guys fly and uh we uh we really appreciate it have a safe trip back I, you know there's a little bit of a hurricane out there that uh they're talking about coming through wednesday which is when we're supposed to fly out so you're probably getting out at a good time yeah yeah we may just have to stay down here a month i don't know but uh, if you're forced to <laughs> if we're forced to. that's why it's important to have studios wherever i go you know <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thank you very much. Appreciate it. Yeah. David Reef, everybody. Uh, We're going to come back and do the shout outs as we normally do. All right. Let me get uh, let me get some music in here for you and uh, grab you some danger coffee. Put a little reef rum in it and uh, come back and have some fun with us. We'll be right back, everybody.